Hello, good evening. Hello, hello, hello. Can you hear me? Yes, you can. All right. Hello, guys. How are you today? How do you feel? Oh, good. And you? How was your day? So far, so good. I don't complain. Let's see. Welcome, everybody. How are you? How was your day, everyone? How do you feel tonight? Good evening, teacher. Hello, how are you? Um, so, so, it's really hot. <laughs> I know, it is. I think that in the whole country, it's pretty hot. Yeah. It's no raining, unfortunately, right? Exactly. I know. <laughs> I hope that the weather improves, but... Ah, the weather forecast it doesn't give so many hopes, <laughs> right? Not so many good news. So well. Yeah, I hope it's improved the weather. I know we need it. All of us needs rains, but anyway, let's keep positive. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Hey everyone, thank you so much for being on time. Today is Thursday. We are basically, guys, almost ending the week. I can see a few people with the camera on, but I can see Edwin. How are you, Edwin? Hi, teacher. I'm fine, thank you. Very good. I can see Amanda too. Hello, Amanda, how are you? I cannot hear you. I'm sorry. Oh. Can you hear me well? uh -huh. Yes, but a little bit low, like if you were very far. I don't think I have a computer in front of me. Now I can hear you better. Okay. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right. Welcome to the class. How was your day? Amanda, how was your day? Oh, sorry. Uh, I'm so busy. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah. Okay. And I can see Kevin too. Hello, Kevin. How are you? I can hear you, Kevin, Alexander. Sorry. <laughs> how uh, are you? Um, I'm really good. I think. <laughs> Very good. Excellent. Okay. Welcome to the class, everybody. Today, we have a lot of practice as always. So I hope you're ready to participate. Um, I can see on WhatsApp group that there will be some people that they will be listeners. Okay. So I totally understand. So the ones that are not going to be listener, I hope you're ready to speak and practice a lot. Do you remember the topic that we studied yesterday? Yes. What was the topic? Um, advantage and disadvantage of e-commerce. Very good. Exactly. That was the topic that we studied yesterday. Today, we are going to continue studying a topic that is related to the e-commerce. Okay. And I expect and I hope that you remember the vocabulary. Okay. So let's start, everyone. I'm going to share the presentation. Can you see the presentation? Yes. Yes, yes? excellent. Yes. Okay, so today is August 10th. And just a reminder of the rules. I know that today is our second day. <clears throat> so remember guys, one of the rules, one of the requirements that INSA Forbes ask is to keep the camera on during the full class. Um, I understand the people that is going to be, you know, listener, but the rest of you guys keep the camera on. With the camera on, you prove that you are here. You prove that you are paying attention, that you are participating, 
okay? Don't forget um, to write your full names on your profiles. Remember your last names and also your names exactly as in your doing. And a reminder, guys, the importance of the attendance, okay? So you have to be connected every single day and you have to be connected the 120 minutes. I mean, the two hours that the class lasts. Let's try to avoid Spanish. And I think that all of you already have the access to the platform. Yes? Yes. Did you already start to work on the platform? Not yet. <laughs> <laughs> okay, not yet. And the rest of you guys? Yes or not yet? Not yet, teacher. All right. I just build a profile. Okay. <laughs> okay. Just looking. <laughs> But it comes. I'm going to work. Okay, okay. Well, remember, guys, that the idea is to finish one week, I mean, one uh, unit per week. Um, we started the week, unfortunately, on Wednesday, right, in the middle. But remember that when we finish the unit number one on the platform, you need to finish the unit number one, too. Okay, so try to start working on it. Please don't wait until the last minute to work <laughs> on it. And like remember, a good <laughs> <laughs> and remember, please, if you have any questions about the exercises or one question that you don't know how to answer it, let me know and I will help you with that. Okay. Now we are in the unit number one in the week number one. And this is the topic for today. Exemplify different types of e-business. So yesterday we were talking about e-commerce. Today we are going to study e-businesses. Okay? This is the class objective. I need a volunteer, please, for reading the class objective. Only one, please. <laughs> Kevin, go ahead. <laughs> At the end of the class, participants will learn vocabulary related to e-businesses and will exemplify different types of e-business based on the interaction between businesses and consumers. That's the one. Thank you. So basically, guys, that's what we are going to do. We are going to check some vocabulary, but also we are going to check different types of e-business, okay? But before that, let's have a quick review about what we studied yesterday. Let's see. Um, yesterday, as your classmate mentioned, we were talking about e-commerce. Do you remember some of the vocabulary that we studied? Brick and mortars. Okay. Oh. <laughs> very good, very good. What else? Another word that you remember? Contour size. Contour size. Side. Drawbacks. Uh -huh. Disappointed. Very good. Uh -huh. Okay. Look. These are some of the words. So I will be asking individually to see if you remember it. So hmm, let's see. Let me start asking to, 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 to Jose Salvador. Hello, Jose Salvador. How are you? Hello, Tisha. How are you today? I'm fine. Excellent. So, Salvador, what is the meaning of e-commerce? What is that? Mm -hmm. Electronic commerce. Ah, very good. Exactly. That's it. Salvador, can you pick one of your classmates, please? Osman Enrique. Okay, Osman. What is the meaning of handcraft? Number two, uh, handicraft. Maybe uh, when people make things uh, uh, ma manual, <laughs> Man manually. Manually. Man mm -hmm. Manually. For sell, for sell uh, tourists. Very good. That's a good idea. 
Um, can you pick one of your classmates, please? Okay. Let me see. Uh, Osman, my oh, classmate, yeah. <laughs> worker, worker, Osman. Thank you, Osman Atilia, number three. What is the meaning of farmer's market? What is that? Um, <clears throat> oh, in general idea, a uh, farmer market is a uh, um, place that uh, the product the uh, farmer. Yeah. For example, vegetable. For example. Mm -hmm. Besides vegetables, what else? Fruits. Fruits. Fruit. Mm -hmm. Well, for, uh, for example, uh, product milk. Yes. Yeah. For example. Correct. Very good. Exactly. So remember, guys, the farmer's market is basically a place where the people sell the products that they have or that they plant in the farmer. Very good. Okay, Osman, can you pick one of your classmates, please? Okay, that is... Um, Oscar Alexis. Thank you. Hello, Oscar. How are you? Hi. How are you? Hello. <laughs> okay. So, Oscar, what, what is countryside? What is that? The uh, countryside maybe are the products that we get in here in the in in country. When you go to a rural place and you need products uh, from 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 the country, that's the countryside products. Mm, okay, countryside products sounds good. So imagine, guys, San Salvador is the countryside. No, 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 not it really, isn't. right? So remember, countryside are like the towns out of the city in the rural area. Pretty mm. good. Okay, Oscar, can you pick one of your classmates, please? Um, let's see, uh, Salvador. Uh, Salvador already participated. Pick ah, sorry, sorry, sorry. I didn't know. Uh, Carlos Ernesto? Okay. Hello, Carlos. Hello. Carlos, number five. What is the meaning of Dropbox? Dropbox, maybe inconvenient. Yeah. yeah okay. <laughs> That's okay. the one. Dropbox is basically, guys, a synonym of inconvenience, problems, issues. All right. And the last one, Carlos, pick one of your classmates. Let's see. And... Jose Salvador. He already participated. Ah, okay, okay. Uh, Nelson Alberto. Okay, Nelson, are you there? Yes. What is the meaning of disappointed? Mm, is when the result of something is not as expected. Exactly, very good. So imagine, guys, that you study a lot for the exam, but you get zero. How will you feel? Bad. <laughs> Terrible. <laughs> yes, totally disappointed. So remember, guys, these words are nouns except the number six. The number six is an adjective is it clear the meaning of these words everybody 
Yes. Yes? Yes, they did. Pretty good. Okay, now I want you guys to pick three of these words, okay? Pick three and you have to write a sentence using one of these words. You can decide, it can be in simple present, in simple past, in future, in the present perfect, the grammar tense that you prefer. But remember that we are intermediate five. So I want to see very interesting sentences. You have to write the sentences and send it on WhatsApp's group. This is for right now, but pay attention. Send the three sentences in only one message. Don't send one by one, no. Write the three sentences in only one message and send it. Don't forget to write your full name because I need to see the person who wrote the sentence. Is it clear, the activity? No, teacher, can you repeat this? Sure. You have to pick three words, the ones that you prefer. For example, you can say, okay, I'm going to pick e-commerce, I'm going to pick disappointed, and I'm going to write countryside. Now, you have to create three sentences using those words. For example, you're gonna start, okay, e-commerce. Okay, let's start writing a sentence using e-commerce. The second sentence, you have to write a sentence using countryside, okay? Write a sentence using countryside. And the sentence number three will be with the word disappointed. You write a sentence using disappointed, okay? Then you write your full name and this message, you have to send it on WhatsApp's group. Okay. Yes? Okay. Is it clear now, everyone? Yes, teacher. How Thank many you. how many sentences are you going to write? Three. Three, Three sentences. Three. Very good. Okay. Do you have five minutes to complete this activity, everybody? Remember, send the sentences on WhatsApp's group. Go ahead. Do you have five minutes? Try to write <clears throat> sorry, interesting sentences. Okay. Remember, these, sen these words are nouns, except with the number six. The number six is an adjective. Okay. Go ahead. If you have questions, just let me know. Teacher, quick question. Um, okay. Do you need our full name or just first and last name? Um, okay, one name and one last name, it's fine. Okay. Yeah, Thank you. you're welcome.
only three sentences. I can see some of your classmates are sending the sentences already. All right, very good. Okay, everybody, time's up. Five minutes already passed. I'm reading the sentences and let me tell you that I liked it. Very good sentences. <clears throat> I like because you are using different grammar tenses, so that's pretty good. Let's see, very good sentences. I'm going to finish reading these sentences uh, after the class because I think I'm not going to be able to do it right now. And if I, if I found it, like a little details, I will let you know, okay? Let's see. Very good sentences so far, guys. I liked it. All right, pretty good. Now, I'm going to finish reading after the class. And if I found like a little mistake, I will send the feedback so you can read it and try to improve that area. Any questions so far, guys, about this vocabulary? Any questions? No? Is it clear, the vocabulary? Yes? Okay, pretty good. Well, yes. Uh, countryside is reference in the plural area <clears throat> only. Yes, basically, we are when we are talking about countryside, we are talking about um when we are discussing about cities or small cities or little towns that are not like in the middle of the city or the big cities, for example. So basically it's just the towns, okay? And we are basically talking about the rural area. Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. You're very welcome. Okay, guys, now before continue, I'm going to check attendance. So when you listen to your name, say present. Um, Amanda Zamora. Amanda, are, are, yes? Present. Okay, very good, thank you. Um, Ana Lorena. Present teacher. Thank you. Boris Alexander. Boris, I think that he's listener, okay. Carlos Alberto. Carlos Alberto. 
Ok. Carlos Ernesto. Present teacher. Thank you. Um, Carlos Mauricio. Carlos Mauricio. Edwin Antonio. Present teacher. Very good. Elias Neptali. Present teacher. Very good. Eulice Torres. Well, his listener. Okay. Irma, Evelyn. Um, she's still sick, I think. Yes. Okay. She She's free of COVID, but she have a... A terrible uh, flu. <laughs> medical, no, medical... Uh, Mission, I don't know. Oh, say. like day off? Yes. Ah, okay. But by medical instruction. Oh, sounds good. Sounds good. Yeah. But the good thing is that out of COVID, right? Yeah. Oh, that's great. <laughs> Excellent. Thank you. I'm, I'm glad to listen to that. <laughs> Thank All you. All right. Let's see. Jose Salvador. Present. Thank you. Osman Atilio. Present. Okay, very good. Kevin Alexander. Present. Thank you. Kevin Alfredo. Uh, Kevin Alfredo, I think he's listener. Okay. Maria Jose. Oh, he's, she's listener too. Okay. Um, Nelson Alberto. Present. Very good. Oscar Alexis. Um, present. Very good. Osman Enrique. Present. Very good. Pamela Carolina. Uh, she's listener to. Rafael Alexander. Oh, he's listener. Okay. Ricardo Ernesto. He's listener to. I have a lot of listeners today. My gosh. Sifrido Ernesto. Sifrido Ernesto Gomez. Present. All right. Wilber Alberto. Present teacher. Thank you. Very good. Okay. Let's continue, everyone. Remember that we are just reviewing the topic that we studied yesterday. So now we are going to have a quick conversation because remember that I always want you to talk. And let's have... Um, some role plays, we are going to divide the teams in two, okay? We are going to go to the breakup rooms and we are going to discuss in teams. The team A, you are a favor of the e-commerce. You are going to tell me basically guys, all the advantages, okay? Remember that yesterday we were discussing what the advantages of the e-commerce we have. And the team B, basically, guys, you are going to tell me the opposite. You have to tell me all the disadvantages, okay? And the idea is to have like a mini debate and we are going to see which teams can generate more ideas. Is it clear? Yes. Yes. Is it clear, everybody, what you are going to do? Yes. Okay. Yes. You have to decide which ones are going to be in the team, team E, and you have to decide which teams are in the team B. Don't forget, guys, you have to tell me all the advantages that you can, that can come to your mind. And the team two, you have to tell me all the disadvantages that comes to your mind, okay? Now, I'm going to send the instructions on WhatsApp's group. I know that there are some classmates that they are listeners, so they are not going to participate, okay? Don't worry about it. If you are in a group uh, that your classmates are not participating or if you are alone, Please just let me know and I will switch you to another team. Let me send the instructions on WhatsApp's group. Let's see, give me a second. Oh, 
Okay, one second, please. Let's see. Okay, I already sent it on WhatsApp's group. Um, you will be in group of four, so you can have two and two, two people that is going to say the advantages and two people that are going to say the disadvantages. But hmm, give me a second because I think I'm going to create the groups manually because I have a lot of listeners. Okay, give me a second. Okay, pretty good. So everybody, let's go to the breakup rooms. Let's see, let's see. Okay, remember? zero Spanish and let's see which team wins. Let's go to work. So. Hello, everyone. Hello. Hello. Mm, what team we are? You are the team of the disadvantages. Um. <laughs> Me, I team B. Okay. The other? It's okay for me, team B. Okay. Okay, Kevin and Hoffman, team A. Okay. Okay. Uh, if you, maybe you start with advantage? Um, we're, we're going, we have to talk about e-commerce, right? <laughs> okay, um, in advantage the e-commerce for me, um, it's important the activity, not in the country, El Salvador, this is the activity in the world, because, uh, uh, in this moment, we commerce I uh, is with uh, shopping in other country and delivery international uh, to arrive to uh, El Salvador. This is a uh, advantage. Um, the company in the country generation the opportunity the job uh, because the the company necessary uh, contract personal I don't know. Uh, for activities, the the e-commerce, for example, the person uh, responsible, the the manage the, the computer, the publish the marketing digital, uh, a customer service, price, uh, deal, and this generation this gener generation the opportunity the job the different person. And the economy, the country generation, the um, impuestos yes. and taxes. Sorry, taxes. Taxes. Thank you. And this is good. The 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 country, the person accuracy the says uh, taxes. The taxes is a. Uh, just the employee, the, the mm, more activities, the, 
the political. For me, this is important and uh, very good opportunity that the, the companies in this, uh, this one and other advantage. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna tell. I'm gonna tell one advantage too. <laughs> um, I think uh, e-commerce are really easy to make. I'm a developer. I'm a programmer. So <laughs> that's why I I can tell you all that. It make an e-commerce. It's like uh, the it's like down one to three, one to three, and it's ready. So uh, anyone can make an e-commerce. They don't need um, technical knowledge to make it. Yeah. Uh, you only have, there are so many websites that can help you make your own e-commerce. Uh, the agenda by Pullman Tour. Do you know Pullman Tour? The, 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 the package services, yeah. They sent to me and I just paid, I don't know, maybe $10 or, or more. Oh, you pay? No, no, I pay the, the agenda because they have international links to pay. So the, uh. the, the bank account was not a problem, but uh, I don't, I can't get physically the, the agenda. But they sent me, it was really cool. I, I, I remember I posting uh, some story about there and they post my story like, oh, we have clients in El Salvador. So, but it was a mistake. <laughs> oh, great. Yeah. Um, another point of view about the positive things about e-commerce and um, the number one, um, more viewers number two more viewers yeah you can make it more social you can uh, get a better person to speak with people or best yeah. best coverage or of uh of, i don't know how to say people i think is market market, is, market um, coverage maybe right Market right coverage yeah yeah mm. connecting to people across the the countryside no it's not for all it's oh, not okay. for all okay it's, okay it's for local economies to okay. them no no it's no. positive or negative no, to them no, it, it, to it the is, local uh, economies thanks i, I don't understand uh, in this case, uh, it's negative because. Uh, mm, yes, I yeah. think it's negative because yes. in the, 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 the local commerce uh, lose potential clients. Yes, you, you have reason. You have reason. Yes, you have reason. Right. Uh, because uh, people, not native people, they can, can sell uh, their products. Yeah. Um, yes. Uh, I think e-commerce is negative because of that. Uh, yes. Local people start losing clients, and they start uh, the client the, the clients start getting offers in other places, and you start losing that uh, that sellings. So I choose the team B. Disadvantages. Okay. What do you think, Ernesto? Another disadvantage or another advantage you you thinking? Let me see. Uh, uh, me, see. another disadvantage from e-commerce uh, uh -huh. could be the. The delivery time is too long, and ah, the delivery time, uh huh. Yeah, yeah. And other, and uh, the product, um, 
it's not but for local it's... but 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 wait uh, for okay. local economies that is an uh, an advantage because uh, uh, an, an local economy um has an immediate deliver yeah so it's not a disadvantage in that case because um to in for an e-commerce is a is a it's a disadvantage but for the local economy that's an advantage i think i think i don't yeah, know what you think it's about correct it. yeah it's correct yes. it depends of the the site if you are seller uh -huh. Or if you are buyer, I don't know. Yes, but the... remember that we are in the position of the local economies. Oh, okay, think... okay, okay uh -huh. sorry. We need to think of them, not on us. Okay, 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 and then uh, it's an advantage. <laughs> <laughs> but and faster because you can see a. Uh some page in a minute maybe is a facility when you buy a, in local you need a move from one a store to other store is more it's, it's no the process yeah <laughs> you lost you lost many, you lost many time uh, moving to the other store is not like using uh, the website. You only have to make a few um, clicks and you are on the other page, right? <laughs> yes, it's more, it's faster. Yeah, it's, really, it's more faster. Yeah, so in the case, uh, the the disadvantage I can see at the camera is when the people don't, sorry, the people can use the technology for, uh, for buying, uh, every, uh, sorry, for buying everything that they want. So some people, now don't have a credit card or can use the cell phone or computer to buy anything in, on internet. Yeah, that, that's a good point. <laughs> uh, people that only know how to buy person to person or not are too good uh, with technology, they can't use e-commerce to buy. Okay, and the other... All right, time's up. Let's wait for everyone to go back to the main room. All right, time's up. Time's up, time's up. Okay, let's wait for everyone to go back to the main room. I was listening some debates in some groups. That's interesting. Let's see, we are going to wait for your classmate. Let's give them a moment. All right, all right, everyone. How was the practice? Easy or difficult? Uh huh. How was the practice? Easy. Easy. All right. Difficult. Difficult. <laughs> I was listening a very difficult debate in some groups. Let's see, who were the winners? The advantages or disadvantages? Team A or Team B? Who are the winners? It's a draw. <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh, guys. Who gave more, um, more details? Who gave more 
um, sentences, more ideas? Team A or Team B? Or was it a tie? Uh -huh. Yes, it's a tie. A tie, okay. Yes. Did your classmate guys speak only in English? Yes. Yes? yes. Okay, pretty good. Yeah. Now, look at this one. I was listening to the groups and I like the point of view that they were explaining. That's great. I know that some people have like more ideas, like think fast. So, but so far so good. I liked it. There are little details that we always um, need to consider. Little details grammatically, okay? For example, need buy. Can I say this? Need buy. To, to buy, need to buy. Correct. Don't forget that we need to separate the verbs. Now, it's more faster. It's faster. That's the one. Remember, this is a short adjective. So, mm -mm, more? No. It's faster. Okay, very good, guys. Now, any questions so far about the e-commerce and its advantages and disadvantages? No? No. Are you good at debate? Yes. <laughs> yes? Or debates are difficult for you? What do you think? Anyone? Debates? Easy or difficult for you? What do you think? Mm -hmm. Difficult? Yes. Maybe so, so, sometimes uh, I have ideas about the other group. <laughs> <laughs> ah, oh my goodness. So you have more ideas about the other team than yours. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh my gosh, yes. The idea for this kind of activities, guys, is because I want you to think fast and I want you guys to be able to organize your ideas because you need to explain your points, okay? That's why these kind of activities are important because sometimes we know the idea, but we cannot explain it. We cannot find the words. And that is one of the difficulties that we can have, okay? So no worries, because we are going to continue practicing speaking. Now, let's see. I'm going to start sharing the presentation again. Can you see the presentation? Yes, teacher. Yes, yes? teacher. Excellent. Yes. Okay, now we already talked about e-commerce. Now let's change and let's start with the topic for today. That is the e-businesses. Okay, so when you listen to the word e-businesses, what comes to your mind? What is that? What do you think? Um, uh, businesses that are, um, or they that offers um, online things like this um, fintech, okay, uh, financial um business but they you are using an app to to use or to to i don't know how to say it. um uh um uh, um uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, 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 what prestamo ah oh, a loan 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 Okay. It's, it's like this. L O A A R. Ah. Yes. Okay. okay. What else? What else? That's a good point. What your classmate mentioned. Yes, that's a good idea. What else, guys? What else May comes to your mind? Mm -hmm. Maybe a uh, business completely uh, online, uh, the transaction, the product uh, maybe are technological and don't have a um, physical maybe product. Okay, sounds good. That's a good idea. 
Remember, guys, when we talk about e-commerce, basically we are talking about sell products, right? Yeah. But yeah. in the e-business, are we necessarily talking about to have a physical product? No. I no, we are. Uber. Oh. It's not necessary. Ah, so when we're talking about e-businesses, as your classmate said, right, it's a full company. The only difference is that it's virtual, not necessarily to get a product or to buy a product. It can be a service, right? It can be a transaction, okay? So we have different options here. Now, uh, think about our country. How many online businesses can you name? Do we have e businesses here in El Salvador? Yes. Yes, we have. Have. <laughs> Yes, that's a good one. What else? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's another one. What else? Another business? E business? The yeah. apps. Okay, I listen to two people at the same time. Amanda, what do you say? The delivering apps. Yeah, okay. What else? I listen to someone else. Uh -huh. The store electronic. Okay, yes. Anyone else? For example, the Pizza Hut, they have a robot. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but in that case, when we are talking about robots, that is more um, physical. It's very technologic advanced, yes, but remember that when we are talking about if businesses is everything online. That means that you can do the, uh, the transaction. But... <laughs> Be careful with the microphones, please. Now, the next one, what business activities can you do online? Yesterday we talked about it, to buy products, but besides that, besides buying a product, what else? What another activity can we do online? Talking about business. Mm -hmm. Maybe uh, when you use um, app of the bank, the transaction, the payment, and other activities? Yes, very good point. Actually, guys, today you can live without the cash, right? You can receive your payment online, and you can pay online too. Very good. What else? We can receive a class online. <laughs> that's another one look at this guys imagine what we do right here is this a e-business yes or no yes yes do you receive a physical object no no, no really you receive a service so that is basically e-business what else Another activity that you can do online, talking about e-business? Mm -hmm. You can make governmental uh, transactions. Yes, that's true. And the taxes uh, report. Basically, you can pay everything, right? You can pay your bills, the taxes, basically almost everything, right? So look at this one. Do you think that e-businesses is important or not? Yes, they are important. Yes. Yeah. Nowadays, I can see even, guys, there are some websites um, where you can find doctors, psychologists online. Imagine that is kind of interesting. That is very new. So we can do almost everything. Now, Teacher, yes. Also, we can we can book trips, uh, airplane, car, taxis. Yes, access. exactly. So imagine if you want to travel. 
easy. Go to the website and you can book everything. The hotel, the taxi, the flight, everything you can do it online. So if businesses is something huge nowadays. And the last one, imagine guys that you had your own e-business. What would it be about? What kind of e-business would you like to have? What do you think? Any idea? Imagine that you have your own company. Maybe um, accounting service. Ah, oh, sounds That's... good. Maybe it'll be my my product. <laughs> so, well, I mean, it sounds very interesting. I like that. Anyone else? Imagine that you have your own e-business. What would it be about? I like to make art. Art? Yeah. Mm, okay. So what kind of art would it be? Pictures, drawings? Maybe pictures, portraits, and... Oh. Background. I like to paint, so... Ah, sounds good, sounds good. Aha, uh -huh. what else, what else? Another idea, guys, for your own e-business? Aha, uh -huh. no? Okay, think about it. Remember guys that the electronic world is growing. <laughs> so we never know, maybe in the future, you can have your own e-business. So is it clear this word, e-business? Yes? yes? We understand the difference between e-commerce and e-business. Is it clear the difference? Anyone, can you explain me? What is um, the difference between e-commerce? Yes, go ahead. I try. Uh, e-commerce is uh, it's when you are an a seller and you want to sell uh, some product. Mm -hmm. And uh, e-business is when you sell some service that this is, uh, this is not physically, so is just uh, online. Sounds good, excellent. And it's, it's basically that. Remember guys, e-commerce is just related to sell and buy products online, okay? It's like a store. The only difference is that it's virtual. E-business, on the other hand, it's more general. It's include like, more kind of companies. As you were mentioning, you can buy, you can pay, you can have a lot of kind of activities, not only buying, not only a physical product, but also different services, okay? Is it clear now the difference between e-commerce and e-business? Yes? Yeah. Pretty good. If you have a question, please just let me know. And remember, I want you to participate. Now, let's check some grammar about this topic. And again, we have some <clears throat> vocabulary. Okay, with the first word is platform. Talking about e-commerce, what comes to your mind when we see the word platform? What is that? The way or the uh, resource that we use. Okay. To make the e-commerce or the e-business. Sounds good. Sounds good. What else? Another idea? About platform? Maybe the website the, when you uh, were you can find the product, the price, a uh, catalog, uh, and um, the all information about the, the business. Mm -hmm. Sounds good, sounds good. 
So remember, even here, we use a platform. What is the platform that we use for the class? Zoom. Zoom. Zoom, right? And also, if you want to practice the exercise, you also have another platform. So basically, we are talking about the virtual space where you have or develop your business. Now, number two. Okay, we already checked e-commerce, e-business, and now we have m-commerce. What do you think, guys? What is that? No idea. No idea? Anyone? No. E-commerce mm, is a, a business and the mobile. Very good. Oh. Imagine in this case, guys, the letter M is for mobile. Do you need the computer? If you want, for example, to, I don't know, to have a transaction for your bank, do you need the computer? You can use your mobile. Exactly. Mm -hmm. If you want to pay something, mm -hmm. you can do everything on your mobile. Clear example of this. Right now, are you receiving the class on the computer or on your mobile? A computer. The computer. Some of you are on the computer. computer. Is anyone from, from the, the cell phone? Tablet. tablet? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So look, we can use different devices, computer, tablet, and even the cell phones. So nowadays, M-commerce is very common because remember that, I mean, our smartphones are basically like mini computers, right? That is the meaning for M-commerce. Then we have local e-commerce. What is that? What do you think? Um, like where you live, e-commerce? Mm -hmm. For example, El Salvador's e-commerce. Basically. So imagine I live here in El Salvador and I am looking at a website from China. <laughs> Is that a local e-commerce? No. no, not really, right? But if I'm looking for a website of a business that is located here in El Salvador, specifically in San Salvador, is that a local e-commerce? Yes. Definitely, very good job. Okay, the next word is auctions. What is that? Have you ever seen that word? Yeah, it's when you own a part of a company Mm -hmm. I don't know what, what more to say. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What do you think, guys? What is the meaning of auctions? I think it's when uh, there are so many people offering for a, for a product. For example, a car. Ah, very good. Yeah. So look at this one. These auctions, I'm going to share a picture. Uh, I think it's here. Look at this picture. Oh. I have a bit of painting here. It's very expensive. And this is an auction. They you are... can make your own offer. Exactly. So basically, they are going to sell a product to the best bid or the best person, the best offer. Okay, that is auction. Is it clear? Yes. Yes. And then related to auctions, we have bids. Let's go back to the picture. Bids. So what do you think? What is bids? Is how many money you offer? Exactly. Bids is basically the offers that you do, okay? So for example, some people say $100, uh, no, $200, okay? So we have different bids, different offers, okay? Is it clear, the vocabulary, everyone? Yes. Only one says yes, and the other ones? Yes, the Yes? Okay, let's see if it is true. We are going to have an exercise. 
This exercise is in your manual in the page 11. So I have here these words, okay? And I have different meanings over here. I just want you guys to match the words with the correct meaning, okay? Read carefully. You will have three minutes to complete this activity and then we are going to see if your answers are correct or not, okay? Go ahead, match the definitions with the correct word. You have three minutes, go ahead. Is it clear, the activity? Yes? Yes. Okay, perfect. Yes. Okay, go ahead. Did you finish or no yet? Yes, I done. Okay, the rest of you guys, you ready? Yes, teacher. Yes. Okay, let's see. I need a volunteer. What is the the first one? Platform. Um. Uh huh. Go ahead. It's okay. a software application that allows online businesses to make their websites. Sales and operations. Okay. What do you think, guys? Do you agree with him? I'm agree. Yes, I agree. Yes. Let's see. Yes, that's the one. Very good. Kevin, can you pick one of your classmates, please? Um, let me check. <laughs> um, <thank you. laughs> I'm sorry? Oh. <laughs> okay, next. Um, in commerce for me is electronic commerce conducted on mobile phones. Do you agree, everyone? I agree. Yes. I agree. Yes. Yes. Correct. Agree. Very good. Um, Ernesto, pick someone, please. Okay, one second. Um, 
Oh, God, it's a lot of this art. Um, Jose Salvador. Thank you. Jose Salvador, letter C, local e-commerce. What is that? What do you think? Mm, a kind of e-commerce focused on the consumer geographical location. Mm, what do you think, guys? Do you agree? Yes, I agree. Yes, I agree. So I agree. Very good. Excellent. Okay, Salvador, can you pick one of your classmates, please? Lorena. Lorena, number, well, letter D, options. Okay. Uh -huh. What is that? Uh, a public sale in which good or property are sold to the highest bidder. Okay. What do you think, guys? Do you agree? Yes. Yes, yes. I agree. I agree. Totally. Very That's good. <laughs> Very good. And the last one is bids. So we know that bids is basically the offering of a price that we do when we are on a auction, okay? So those words can be related to e-businesses. Is it clear, the vocabulary, everyone? Yes. Yes? Yes, it is. Excellent, pretty good. Did you copy the vocabulary? Yes. 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 Okay. Keep the vocabulary in mind because remember, I can continue asking in the next classes just to see if you remember. Now, let's continue. We already talked about some vocabulary. It's time for the speaking practice. Okay. We are going to work in groups and I want you guys to think think on a popular online business, okay? Uh, you can pick a business um, here in El Salvador, a local business, or you can pick um, a business from another country. It's all right, the ones that you prefer, but it has to be e-business, okay? You have to tell me how this business uh, interacts with the customer. I mean, explain me what's the business about. And you have to describe the advantages and disadvantages that this business offers as the customers, but also what are the advantages and the disadvantages for the owners, okay? You have to work in teams then we are going to go back to the main room and you will present the information, okay? For example, um, imagine, <clears throat> I'm sorry, <laughs> I have some sore throat, that's why sometimes my voice is weird, but I'm going to give you the example. I'm going to pick up e-business and the e-business is in Sephora, online. <laughs> Have you ever heard about this e-business? No. <laughs> it's totally <laughs> new, right? <laughs> so the first things that you need to do is to describe, okay? This e-business basically, guys, offers different courses. You can learn different courses. For example, Excel, you can learn the most common one is for English classes, but this business is online. So you can receive the classes online. Some of the advantages, now listen, we start with the advantages for the customers. So some of the advantages for the customers, what do you think guys? We can access from anywhere. Exactly. You can connect everywhere. I mean, you can be at home. You can be, imagine that you have to travel because of your job to another country. You can connect easily from there. Uh, imagine that you go 
to visit your family, you can connect as long as you have internet. Another advantage, what else? You as a student, guys, you are the, uh, the customer, you are the consumers. What advantages can you find? For the customer, uh, for, for the consumers, it is more cheap. It is, it's cheaper. It's cheaper. Thank you. That is the it's one. Cheaper. It's cheaper because imagine, guys, you don't have to pay for transportation to yes. move to the school, for example. You don't have to pay a book. You don't have to pay for photocopies, <laughs> right? So, in, in this way, it's cheaper. Also, the schedule is more convenient. Very good, the schedules. Imagine, guys, you can study different times, especially at night, that in face-to-face -face classes, this schedule is not so common. And because you are at home, it's safer. I mean, you don't have to be in the streets very late at night. And so on. we can continue naming different advantages. But remember, you have to talk too about the disadvantages. Okay, for the customers, some disadvantages. What do you think? One of the most common is when we have bad connection, right? Yes, so, the internet is down. <laughs> when the internet is down, you cannot receive the class. If the light went out, you cannot receive the class. Those are some of the disadvantages. What else? Another disadvantage? What do you think? Uh huh. No. Not for me, but maybe uh, always uh, somebody wants to a different uh, schedule. Ah, very good. You you can't uh, choose your own schedule. Yeah. You need to select the the availabilities. Exactly. That's another detail, right? There are some options. <laughs> But that's the one that you have to pick, the ones that are there. And if you see, I mean, you can check and name the different disadvantages. Now, disadvantages and disadvantages are for the consumers. Now, you have to explain the next one that are the advantages and disadvantages for the owners. You have to think about the point of view of the owners. One of the advantages for the owners, what do you think? The cost. Very good. They don't have to pay for a building. They don't have to pay for the electricity bills or the internet bills because, I mean, they don't have physical office like brick and mortar office. All right, another advantage that the owners can have, what do you think? More potential customer, because uh, um, we live in different departments. All right, that's another idea. They can have more access, right? They can get more customers from different places. Because imagine if we have a school in San Salvador, do you think that someone from Santa Ana can take classes at 8 p.m.? No, right? <laughs> yeah. So we can easily get from students from different places. That's another advantage. Pretty good. So again, you can name different advantages for the owners. Now, disadvantages. What are the disadvantages for the owners? What do you think? When the platform is down. 
Very good. Remember what we talked about yesterday when the website is down? What happens, guys, if suddenly <laughs> Zoom stop working? What can we do? Mm, you what's up? <laughs> <laughs> In this case, I mean, we can just talk through what's up, right? But we cannot develop the class, okay? Mm. So that is one of the disadvantages. Also, what we talked about yesterday, the loyalty. Do you think that it's easy to have the loyalty from the customers when we have uh, like a lot of competitors? No. No, right? So that is another disadvantage. And again, we can name different disadvantages for the owners. So exactly what I just did, that is exactly what you have to do. Is it clear, the activity? Yes. Yep. Yes, sure. Excellent. Yes, Okay, so think about a company, guys, uh, e-business. Again, you can pick something from here in El Salvador, a local e-business, or you can pick another business from another country, okay? We are going to do it in teams, but later, guys, you are going to present the information. Now, if you want to create a PowerPoint presentation, that's good. It's optional. Okay, if you don't create a presentation, it's okay. But what I need is that everybody in the group has the information and you can present it. Got it? Yes? Pretty good. Okay, I'm going to create the groups. I'm going to send the information also on WhatsApp's group. Give me one second. Um, I want to be clear for the listeners. I'm not going to include listeners to um, the groups because, well, basically they are just listeners, right? And because I have a lot of listeners, actually. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Give me a second. Remember when we are in the teams, I want to everybody please participate. Everybody give their opinions. Okay, we are going to be in group of three. And when you finish, guys, we are going to go back to the main room and present the information. Now, just let me send the instructions on WhatsApp's group. Don't complicate too much, right? Try to keep it simple. Try to pick a common company. Okay, are you ready, send it? Are you ready, everybody? Yes? Yes. Excellent. Yeah. Pretty good. Let's go to work. Thank you. Good. Yeah, the thing, the companies. Hey, uh, write or just speak? You are mute, Osman, sorry. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Uh, for me, just speak. Okay. I don't, I don't okay. know if you if, if you want write, no problem. But for me, it's more easy. It's only speaking. Speak. It's okay. okay. More easy to speak. Okay. 
Okay, yes. Uh, where where we, we we had to to choose a, a company? Do you have an idea? Mm. Could see. be a company service. Company service, for example. Uh, mm. Lab. Uh, delivery. Mm. Mm. I don't. Yes. Mm, I, I don't know. Uh, Hmm. I uh, mm, maybe be uh, a call center. Right. No. Mm. I don't know. No. I don't know. <laughs> I don't. I don't have idea. <laughs> Plasmate. I'm sorry. Um, it's okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, uh, commerce, commerce. Maybe a uh, pay. No, I uh, know. Yes, I think I was thinking uh, the payment. Hello. Okay, I see that you are just two. I think that your other classmate didn't join. So guys, I'm going to send you to another team, okay? Or do okay. you already pick a business? Not yet. No? Okay, I'm going to send it to another team because you are just two, okay? Okay. All right, give me a moment. More quickly, back. more quickly transaction. Yes. And uh, how? Don't need a uh, go to the bank. Mm, how can we say that um, online? Mm, mm, Oscar? No, I don't know. <laughs> wow. Si Frido, hi, hello. Uh, our hello, business hi. is Banco Agricola. Um, it's up, a specific. Um, yeah, uh, advantage and uh, more quickly transactions. And... and the other, you don't need to uh, go to the bank to. to uh... Online, but what <laughs> online? Uh... Online transfers? Transfer. Maybe. Mm -hmm. mm, I think that could be if you can do transfer to your accounts 24 seven. Okay, yeah, yeah. That's a good one. Yeah. Um, hello, guys. What is Hi. the hello, business? Teacher. Um, baby, those, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I like that. Um, Edwin is here. Edwin Antonio, I joined it here. So you can listen to his opinions too, all right? Okay. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Hi, Edwin. And we're talking about uh, the advantage for the uh, the owner the um, the business <laughs> uh, uh, the business that we that we pick is pedidos yeah uh, the food delivery uh, app I think you know it <laughs> yes I use it I'm a writer <laughs> yes. <laughs> Um, um another advantage is the 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 choose 
of the rest uh, of the restaurants the many you have many selections or many mm. options to get your yeah food. but that will be an advantage for the user i think yes for, for the customer exactly. uh, customers stays here <laughs> yeah an advantage yeah is that they can choose mm, from many options of restaurants and different type types of of, of foods Another advantage uh, for the customer is the, the the accessibility to the mobile phones. Yeah, because this is yeah, an app everyone a has, has one. Yeah, you 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 don't need a computer, for example. Yeah. Hmm. Another advantage for the consumers, I think that you can gift uh, things, things to family or friends, and they do everything. They pick the present and they uh, move it to the the friend's family, friend's house or the family house, and you don't have to do anything else than. <laughs> yeah, I bought some gift on Ugo app when that app exists. <laughs> I bought some some gifts for friends and family, and they um drive uh the things to their their house, <laughs> and I'm only paid right. <laughs> Yeah, it's true. Okay. So advantages for the owner could be um they don't need a work as a biker because they are the owner about the application and they only need to update the application for the other user. Uh, this is like delivery app, right? Yes. Delivery. Okay. Delivery. Oh. Uh, the goal is my daughter is is it's is past it's happened it's happened uh, the situation. For example, uh, the the miss uh, send the, the message mm -hmm. to the group. Uh, in, in this case, for example, the mothers. Okay. Uh, uh, for example, uh, today, uh, tomorrow, uh, the children uh, comes uh, the the pants. Okay. Uh, and they are right the pants. It's not the I don't know falta. Uh, but uh, the miss give give them the uh, the mothers uh, indication uh, in the indication. Okay. The WhatsApp. Yes, I, I think that is a, 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 a it is a main uh, advantage for a principal. Yeah. And teachers also. Uh, also, I think uh, other uh, other advantages is uh, the communication is direct with the with the uh, parents, Wilbert, uh, relatives. Wilbert, uh, relatives, relatives, yeah. right? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> that's all. Okay. 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 Yes. 
uh, for example, uh, when, uh, when there is uh, the meeting, uh, the specific, message is specifically direct. what? The message is direct for all uh, relatives. Yeah. Uh, for example, uh, with my daughter, uh, my wife and me, uh, we have the meeting uh, for Zoom. Yes. Maybe uh, maybe I uh, I stay in, in Sultan, my wife in your house. Yes, uh, yes. The meeting is can can to do is all uh, mm -hmm. other advantage. Okay. Uh, well, I uh, want to listen. I want to listen to Wilbur too. What do you think, Wilbur? Yes, uh, I was talking with them about the disadvantage. Uh, I was telling them, uh, uh, for example, our principal ha uh, has many, many, so many groups uh, with relatives. And when he wants to make a send, he, when he wants to send a message, a message, he send it to our principal administrator on the WhatsApp group. And after that, he sent the, the, the message to our son group. Uh, I mean, he yeah. he is, uh, 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 it, it is an advantage for him because he sent that message di uh, most directly. Yes. Sounds good. So, did you finish? Mm, no, no. <laughs> okay, continue, please. You are doing great. I like it. Okay, other advantage is the pay the books. Uh, for example, uh, I didn't for computer the pay the books and then the print the sheet. Uh, you don't, buy, you, don't, you don't buy books. What? You don't buy books. Yeah. You don't need you don't need to buy books. I, I don't understand. <laughs> physical uh, books. You don't need to pay or to buy uh -huh. physical books, paper books. Uh, no. Um physically no. Uh, is e-commerce but interesting uh, um, pick up pick up the books <laughs> is physically in the college recover physically pick up only only the the pay books uh, is only uh, e-commerce is is faster okay or... let me know if i understand uh, in your daughter school they don't buy a uh, physical books but uh, you have access to, uh, to an, a platform to view all your books virtually is something like that? Mm, I think. The question here, Carlos, is you buy the books and you receive the physical books. I mean, the papers, right? Like, for example, imagine that I'm going to share my... my this is a physical book. I don't know if you can see it. <laughs> but I have a book. So do you receive the physical book or is a virtual book like the one that you use here in the class? You know that you don't receive the book, it's virtual. So mm -hmm. how is the book that you use? Uh, the books, uh, uh, we, we pick up 
uh, we arrived the college. Ah, and you received a, a paper physical. book, like physical. Physical, yeah. Ah, okay. okay. Only the pay, only the pay is the e-commerce. Ah, okay. you pay for the books online. Yeah. Ah, got it. Okay. Okay, okay. I understand now. <laughs> okay. It's, it's similar, for example, a uniform is the same. Mm -hmm. Here uh, in my daughter's school, uh, you have the two options. You can pay cash or you can make a transaction also. I think that is a... Right. Bad customer service. Okay. Yeah, be because sometimes it takes a lot of time for the they it takes many time to to they to add, to answer your your problem or, or to help you with your problem you finish no <laughs> not yet i can see that you already have the customers advantages customer disadvantages Okay, because of the time, guys, I recommend you to start with the owner's advantages and disadvantages, okay? Okay. Pretty good. Beautiful presentation, by the way. Thank you. I really have a, a big issue with the end, Kevin. <laughs> <laughs> I see. Uh, the, I green one, the, the, green one, <laughs> the green one, I think it missed the end, too. Oh, no, no. It has one A, one extra A. It this says advantage. advantages. No, the next one, uh, number three. No, number number two. And and, and advantages has an N on, and the, on, the, on, the, on the start. Yes, yeah. thank you. And it, it says and. I am a dyslexic woman. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> Just delete the second letter, the N, and the, and, and. Okay. it's add, A, G. It says A, N, G, yeah. And it misses the Ada. N, uh, the, uh, oh, band, yeah. the, yes, yes. Now we have, finally, finally, Amanda. <laughs> Customer you have five more minutes, so hurry okay. up, please. Um, Kevin, you say the cost. Um, uh, advantages of the owners. Um, um yes. the cheaper cost, cheaper, cheaper cost, cost. cheaper, cheaper cost of. Um. Mm. Bills uh, and rent, office. office bills. You can help her, guys, sending your ideas in the chat. So for her, it will be easier to, you know, type it. So, oh. Hosman, yeah, Hosman and Edwin also, yes. you can write the idea so she can only copy and paste. You know, it will be easier for her. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> thank, thank you for you. the idea. You're welcome. Oh, sorry. <laughs> All right. How is everything going over here? <laughs> yeah. Great. <laughs> Not so <laughs> fine. <laughs> <laughs> Elias looks like you're having a party. <laughs> yeah. The, uh, learn English is a, it's a big party. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I like it's that. <laughs> Elias. Yeah. Elias. The word Cali Cali Quali is incorrect. Yeah, yeah. That, that was a, I, I was Cali about Quali. I was about to ask what the meaning is. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> we we have a little distraction. Qualified. Qualify. Uh, the first uh, um, is five. La quali qualifier. Ah yes. Yeah. Three more minutes, and then we go back to the main room, okay? I, I will check. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Very good. Thank you. And 
One more disadvantage, yes? This, this word. And disadvantages. Yes. Okay, guys, three, three more minutes. <laughs> no, teacher. No. <laughs> right, the the, the, what the, the, what the do other say teams demanded? already finished. So. <laughs> okay. How do you we say are, We are trying to crumble all this conversation. <laughs> Organize your ideas. Yeah. Yes. This conversation is interesting. <laughs> <laughs> yes. It's... I there there are different experiences. Okay, but let's go back on track. Focus on the advantages and disadvantages. Do you have the information ready? <laughs> yes, teacher. We are talking a lot. Um, maybe we we have more advantages, right? Okay, then disadvantage. Uh, but in this case, uh, I believe uh, we uh, spoke uh, more about owner, right? Okay. Advantages <laughs> of owner. Yeah. All right. So don't forget to name some of them for the customers too, okay? Okay. Okay. Two more minutes. You can continue giving ideas. Two more okay. minutes. Okay. Uh, uh, Carlos and Wilbur, uh, I, I I want to share something with you. Okay. Uh, I, I I ask you I I ask you about how how difficult can be create a platform, because uh, I I only share. Uh, uh, I have a a local local a lo uh, store. I have a store a, a small store. Uh, I don't, yeah. I don't, I don't know if you understand me. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. I, 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 in my town, in my city, I have a a, a store. Yeah, it, it's it's small, uh, three three meter in front. Uh, but it, the local is on on principle on main street on main street. But uh, I I rent a, a a people. I rent a people. Uh, when 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 the people pay me, uh, 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 the people made uh, the transfer the transferencia the transfer Transfer in my yes. my cuenta bancaria. I don't know. Um, to your uh, own uh, count. How, how do you say your, to your to your own count? Own count. Yes. Bank uh, uh, account. An account. Band? Account. Band. Okay. And, 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 the, and, and the people. All right. Time's up. We are going to wait for everyone to return to the main room. Time's up, time's up. All right, time's up everyone. Let's return. Let's go back to the main room. All right, time's up. How was the exercise? Easy or difficult? So, so teacher. <laughs> I could see that in some groups, they were talking a lot about their experiences. Some other were like having fun. <laughs> I like that. So I can see different things. But now it's time to present the information. I want you guys to share your information with the rest of your classmates. So I will be asking a group, each group, the rest of you guys, please pay attention what your classmates are going to present. Let's start with the team number one. I have Carlos, Osman, and Wilbur. 
So guys, what is the company that you picked? Uh, the, I don't remember the night teacher, but <laughs> <laughs> it's about a, a, a college. College. Okay, it's Carlos, college. Wilbur, do you remember the name? Uh, the name, no, but we were talking about in general, uh, about a college. Oh, okay, yeah. sounds good. Okay, let's start with the customers or consumers. What are the advantages? For example, yeah, yeah I'll go ahead. Okay. Go ahead, it's mine. Okay, uh, 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 about uh, owner advantages, uh, for example, uh, they have more control uh, about uh, his customer. For example, uh, the principal, uh, um, the communication, the principal from uh, from uh, from uh, uh, parents is 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 direct is direct. Is direct uh, <laughs> and you heard Ernesto. <laughs> okay, Carlos and Wilbur, continue help him. He's talking about the owner's advantages. So continue with the owner's uh, advantages. Yes, uh, Osman was, try was trying to talk about the uh, advantage owner. Mm -hmm. uh, one of the one of them can be a uh, that uh, he can have a more a uh, best control about uh, relatives. For example, uh, in my daughter's school, uh, we have a WhatsApp group in each section. Okay. In each in each section, it has a an administrator in each group. So the the principal sends a a message message to our administrators, and uh, the administrator sends the message in our world. Uh, was a group okay so mm -hmm. so that's the way he has a better control with a uh, uh with us uh just like uh, relatives and uh, when he wants to a uh, uh, we know uh, uh, some topic about the the the, the college just like just like a affair we had we had a, a Every event, every yeah. event, in every event, uh, <laughs> we had to know uh, our uh, the schedule, uh, 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 so and so. No, okay, uh, that's a uh, an advantage. Uh, but uh, maybe the opposite of this advantage, uh, uh, it could be he cannot uh, answer all the questions at the same time. Yeah, yes. imagine a lot of people writing. Yes, yes. Uh -huh. <laughs> so many parents has a, a their their own questions, a in in some in one row. So a, he not he has not enough time to answer all questions. All right, mm -hmm. that's a disadvantage. What else? Another disadvantage for the owners, guys. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. It, Maybe uh, but, better but, control the, the the college. Maybe. Okay. Hmm. Anything else? Or let's move on to the customers, the consumers. What advantages the consumers have? Mm, there are there are uh, ideas. Well, for example, a uh, forest man. Uh, it was uh, a disadvantage for me. It's advantage, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. For for my job, uh, uh, I don't, I don't have uh, the time. For example, for for arrive the college, okay. Uh, the college, uh, uh, they have the platform. Uh, I pay the platform. Uh, the the college. Uh, they give me uh, the comparable, the payment. So basically you can pay everything online. 
You don't need to go yeah. to the college and pay there. No, you can do it online. What else? Yeah. Uh -huh. um, That's a good advantage. Another advantage, guys, for the consumers? Maybe. Yeah, yeah. okay. The information, also, also uh, all the information uh, the student the student need uh, can find in the platform. Okay, sounds good. Sounds good. For me, for me, um, disadvantages, for example, uh, uh, the money in the street maybe stole. Oh, yeah, it's dangerous. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> definitely. Now, let's move on to the disadvantages for the consumers. What do you think, guys? My case teacher, uh, the college where my children study uh, don't, don't, uh, doesn't have a platform for make the payment. Ah, okay. For this reason, for this reason, for me, it's it disadvantages. Uh, I I had to to get there, personal. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> All right. Another disadvantage for the consumers. No. When the platform is down, also it's when down. Platform, uh, down. Connection. Definitely. Very good. Okay. Anything else, boys? I think that's it's all. It's okay. That's <laughs> all. That's all, teacher. Pretty good. Okay. Thank you, guys. Now, listen. I think that you feel difficult this topic because you did it like very general. I mean, you were talking about like college education, <clears throat> like virtual education, but in general, it will be easier if you had picked only one college, for example, that will be easier. If you do it, <clears throat> sorry, if you did, I mean, if you do it like very general, you will have like a lot of information, right? So next time, right. always try to keep it a little bit more specific, okay? That is right. going to be easy. Maybe it, 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 well, it was because uh, we just uh, spoke about our experience Yes, <laughs> I know, I know. So it is great to share experiences, but guys, let's be always keeping track, okay? Now, unfortunately, we don't have more time, but I already keep the information of the people in the next groups. So guys, please save the information. If you had written something or if you have presentations, save the presentation because tomorrow you are going to present it, okay? Now, um, do you have any questions before leaving? No, teacher. No, no? teacher. Okay, no. because we don't have more time, we are going to stop right here, but as always, we have a winner and the winner for tonight is... Me. Yes. <laughs> How do you know it? Ah, it's because she wants to be the winner. <laughs> all right. So, guys, this is all for today. Thank you so much for being in the class. Have a wonderful night and see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow, teacher. Thanks. Bye. See you. Bye bye. Bye. See you Take care. Bye. See you. <laughs> Only Lorena stays. Goodbye, guys. See you tomorrow. Goodbye. Good night. All right. Well, Lorena, we have a lot of listeners, so maybe they will stay here. <laughs> okay. All right. How are you? Hi, teacher. I am very tired. Yeah. And the uh, weather is very hot. I it's hotter. Oh, it's terrible. Yes. I feel that we need rains, but nothing, right? Yes. <laughs> yeah, it's terrible. But it's Thursday, so yes. almost Friday. Let's resist yes. <laughs> a little bit. Okay. So, you know that this meeting is just to clarify some questions that you may have. So, how did you feel the topics so far? Is it? 
or difficult? What do you think? Maybe so so, but uh, with vocabulary is more uh, no is easier. <laughs> uh, learn the different terms or information about the topic. Okay, pretty good. How was the practice with your classmates about the e business? Is, uh, in my case, I really like because uh, with the new uh, partners uh, can practice uh, maybe better because uh, can uh, have more partners in the group and share the uh, opinions or information. Yeah, I think that that's great to have more people in the group. So yes. when we have a lot of listeners, we still can have some classmates that you can practice with. That's great yes. too. Very good. So in this level in Intermediate 5, Lorena, which area do you think that you need to improve more? Uh, in my case, uh, always I say that I speak because is the most important uh, area that I need to uh, improve. And for this reason, I really like share uh, opinion with my partners or participate in class. That's great, yes. And that is something positive for you. That is my positive feedback because I can see that you're always willing to participate, try to give your opinion. I know that sometimes Organize our ideas is complicated, but even though you try, and that's great because the more that you try, the more that you practice, the more that you will learn. That's yes. excellent. Yes. Pretty good. Okay, Lorena, I don't know if you have any questions or another comments about the class or about the platform. Maybe only uh, ask for the platform uh, because uh, the uh, start the in the middle of the week, and for this reason, I don't understand if I need a end for tomorrow. Part. <laughs> uh -huh. yes. I know. Um, in this case, I know we started in the middle of the week, so of course you will have more time because remember that on Monday and Tuesday we will still um study the unit number one. So basically, okay. when we finish the unit number one, that date is the one that you have to finish uh, the platform in the unit number one. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm not going to say tomorrow <laughs> you have now because we started late. Yeah, so you will have more time. No worries. Okay. Okay. That's pretty Only good. that. Excellent. Okay. So continue practicing, please, because you are doing great. So at the end of this level, you will be better in speaking. Okay. 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 Excellent. Thanks. You're very welcome. Have a good night. See you tomorrow. Thanks. Good night.